All right, back into Sea of Stars we go. So, let's see. I left off trying to obtain a soul stone for Garl, right? Okay. 225 health. Um, this should actually be easier than the last one we did, right? it takes to break his shield. I know it does break, but I wasn't paying attention to how long it would take to do. Alright, that was really easy. <laughs> One more to go, then. I may as well go rest at the campfire, just because it's right here. I'm assuming the last one is in here. just attacked the woodland spirit. Well, I'm not going to complain about that. I didn't realize that would happen, though. <laughs> mm, I may as well boost. I guess there's no reason not to. I keep blocking that way too early. She doesn't have any combos with us yet, does she? No. Wait, I can't unselect the boost now? I thought I could. Oh well. I guess it didn't make a difference at all. Can I grapple up here? Okay. Uh, before I go over there, what's over here? Oh, that's a wall. The perspective is hard to make out sometimes. An Osidious staff. I assume that'd be for you. Why do I keep getting the same tutorial? Can't 
carry any more meals. Might as well eat something, right? If we're all heavily damaged. time everything today too, aren't I? see the grapple point over here. And there we go, that makes more sense. Why am I walking through it? I mean, I guess it doesn't matter. It's not like they damage me when they hit me out of combat. Sunball. I think this will kill the Woodland Spirit, right? Yep. Alright. Recovers 55 HP and 5 mana. Yeah, we need to do that. We're gonna start losing people with this uh, with this next attack. Didn't this one just attack? Why is it attacking again already? Assuming I don't need to hit that again. But there is another switch over in that corner. Uh, maybe I don't hit this switch? Okay, now I hit this one. Okay, sure. Let's just go ahead and heal Valir. Did that do anything? How was I supposed to know that one was coming? What, what? 
They can do literally anything. Like, it's impossible to predict what they're gonna do next. I think it might have been better if she had gotten knocked out there. Because then she, she'd at least recover with a half health, if that were the case. <clears throat> okay, see, that works out. She'll recover with more health than she has now. I guess 17 is still more health. <laughs> it's not quite half. I was hoping for half. Uh, oh yeah, there's the lever over here. Did I do what I needed to do? I guess. These puzzles aren't the most exciting. Like, I get it's an RPG and not a puzzle game, but still. If they're going to include puzzles like this, I would hope that they had commit. That was a good strategy. To weaken it and then... Uh, to weaken it by using all the magic, magic attacks. Okay. Let's go ahead and take you out, So I think the wizards are going to be the biggest threat in this fight.
If I hadn't blocked that, that would have party wiped us. <clears throat> that was really close. be enough. Honestly, having characters get knocked out in battle and then reviving with half health seems like the, the smart strategy sometimes, which is a little bit weird. go into another battle. And then... And give him at least some mana with that. This is looking rough. things don't deal very much damage. The wizards do, though. Jesus. Oh, man. Those things are scary to deal with. a lot more confident with the two of them killed. Now... Too soon. Oh wait, wrong enemy. Whoops. That's hard to react to. Seriously? I imagine we'll be able to get back to the campfire after this, so I might as well go all out. Just use all my mana. There 
go. And we're getting pretty close to leveling up again, too. That's good. Alright, so that should get us the Necromancer. Wait, where's the exit? It's over here, isn't it? for a break, but I gotta use the restroom. I'll be right back. Okay, back to it. So, we should be able to confront the Necromancer now. Uh, this way. So that's what all the ruckus was. And what brings you to my delectable estate? We are looking for a soul stone to save our best friend's life. Oh, I suppose I should simply give you one then. I have a better idea. How about the three of you join my army permanently? Not happening. Oh, look at you taking cur courteous arrow. Erotesis? All serious? What the fuck? You barged in here uninvited and caused irreparable damage to my property, did you not? Seems only fair you would compensate me for my troubles. Don't get overconfident, they are fully trained solstice warriors. Ha! <laughs> this is getting interesting. Are you like those Selena and Luan wannabes who thought they would ascend by fighting me? What are you talking about? An irrelevant matter, much like your very selves. Let us begin. And please don't worry, you won't stay dead for long. 
Okay. So... Let's start with this Orient. Uh, okay, wait, that didn't work as I planned, but we can still make this work. Now, we can use some magic, and we can break that defense. And it's just gonna come back anyway. Okay. Um, but hey, that resets her to four turns. Which, I don't know that we can break through this defense at this point. Charge up a Moonerang, that'll deal some solid damage and weaken her quite a bit. What? Why are there corpses? Flesh pile and bone pile? What the fuck? Holy shit. That was a lot of damage. Keep everybody alive as long as possible in this fight. Okay, we should be able to take this out pretty easily. Yeah. can break her defense with Zale. If I could not fuck up the timing, of course. take out the flesh and bone piles uh, and maybe she can't keep summoning because if I maybe if I take them out she can't keep summoning I have no idea though Save the, uh, no, we can actually combo and still deal some significant damage, can't we? Let's do that. I have no idea if attacking those is doing anything. It sure doesn't seem like it. Okay, that, that is doing something then. Oh, oh, okay, we have to heal here. Ooh, that was, okay, we can time that heal and make it better. Okay, that's good to know. Hey, 
think I want Valera to focus down the bone pile because she deals blunt damage. So I think that's better. I don't, I'm kind of talking out of my ass on that one. I have no idea. Okay. Honestly, I'm not concerned about the Revenant because it deals very little damage. Yeah, 15 is nothing. Go ahead and do the Moonerang here. Yeah, she's not summoning anything now, so taking out those bone and flesh piles is a good idea. Go ahead and do Mending Light again since our combo meter is full. Okay, that was new. Who do we want to attack next? Because we can max boost here. Valir is low on mana, so we're going to build that up a little bit more. Oh, okay, now he deals damage. Holy shit. <laughs> okay, I don't need to worry too much about healing. I don't need to do, like, a combo heal. Oh shit, he's... I was hoping that would take him out. Two out of three wasn't good enough there. Okay, that was it. And the level up, all right. Mm, 
I think magic attack is probably the way to go here. I want him to have more mana so that he can hopefully heal more often. Let's buff her attack. Children, I swear, I am not about to die over a stupid rock. Is she not undead? I yield for now. Here's your soul stone. Now go away. We... What now? We also need a green flame, otherwise the ferryman won't take us back. You do want us to go, don't you? The nerve. The disrespect. Grab a bottle from my desk, then get off my estate. Count your blessings. If we meet again, it won't be a simple three versus one. It wasn't three versus one. You summoned leave. Okay, we got a soul stone. Let's hope we're not too late. Hang on, hang in there, Garl. We're coming. Wow, the AoE damage still did more damage to him than the rake than like the full attack did to the zombie.
You have returned with a soul stone. Quite impressive, though I suppose this means the mistress will be quite upset with me. The exit path is to the right. You will have to make good use of your grapplow. I hope you can get to your friend in time. Farewell. Well, okay. I guess we'll just drop into the water then. Is there really no other way out besides... I guess not. Where the fuck do I go? This, I don't think, is the way out. Okay, I'll take that. What is it? An enchanted scarf. Plus five magic attack. Probably would be better with, uh, Valir. We have one of these I can give you no. Okay. I probably should have avoided this one. God, I can't time these for shit. Blocking that didn't didn't even matter. block that second one a little bit sooner. Oops. Wrong one. Oh well. Holy shit. Okay, this is bad. If they go for that chomp chomp attack, then I'm probably dead. Let's just revive you. Okay, well... I need to go for this because if I don't there's the possibility that I get a heal and that's probably worse um, it's probably my only shot at killing it nope not even close
Oh, I'm fucked. Even with a good block, I died. Shit, that's my first party wipe. <laughs> Damn. Ah. Oh, I need to make sure to go back and get that item. Really? Why are you doing that? I need to make sure to go back and get that chest again, because that part didn't save. give it to you, right? Yeah, I think that's what I did. Uh, let's just skip that fight this time. A green flame you found, I see, aboard my wrath, I welcome thee. So, how does this work? It's pulsing. Maybe if I just... Sarai, how long do you think the poison will... Sarai? She left. We didn't even get to thank her. What a strange character. Might as well get comfortable. This could take a while. And then you were all, well, if I don't get a sword, how will I do backflips? Um... Valir, something happened when he got mind-controlled. What do you mean? I don't understand it. It was like a floodgate opened in the pit of my stomach. Like when we were first learning magic? Sort of, but way, way stronger. Do you think it was the Dweller? No, it didn't feel evil or even bad. A response to seeing Garl in danger, but I couldn't let it in. I feared it would overwhelm me. Maybe I could have helped him, but... If Sarai hadn't showed up, he... Zale, we're all safe now. That's all that matters. I think that was my prophecy. What do you mean? The Elder Mist? He told me I had potential, but first needed to stare at the night inside of me. I think this is what he meant. The thought of losing a loved one. I felt the power, but I couldn't actualize it. I wouldn't overthink it. Prophecies are not swayed by the attention we give them. Aren't you curious about yours? He said I might be able to create paths on water. What does that even mean? Yeah, talk about cryptic. The way I look at it is going to happen or not, no matter how much sleep I lose over it. You have such a relaxed outlook. I wish I was born on the winter solstice, too. <laughs> you and Erlina sure have more intensity. I suppose you and I even each other out, in a way. That's part of why we make a good team, I guess. 
or maybe it's because stealing my live mana helps you show off. Forget it. You do it way more than I do. Ugh. Garl. Hey, I... Welcome back, Garl. I just had a really bad dream, you guys. You're safe now, buddy. Don't worry about it. What happened? Remember how we couldn't stop that villager from entering the mansion? It's a bit blurry, but yes. Well... Whoa, you mean she could kind of teleport? By carving magic geats out of thin air somehow. This is too much. Hopefully we'll get to meet her again. I've got to see that. Welcome to the first stage of grief. Please have a seat and I will be right over. Thank you, innkeeper. We won't be staying long. Why, of course not. Hey, that's the headmaster's voice. They're here. Well, look who made it here on time. Hey, everyone. It's so good to see you. The eclipse is upon us. I, oops, I didn't mean to do that. We wouldn't want one of you to end up mind-controlled by the Dweller now, would we? Oh, that happened already. Excuse me? We went into the woods and the Dweller mind-controlled me, but an assassin used paralyzing poison to buy some time, and they went to fight a necromancer, and... A necromancer? You mean to tell me Zale and Valer fought Romaya and lived? We had help. These two, I swear. No matter. We must leave for the Dweller's Lair at once. I will explain on the way. Last chance to make preparations. Let me know when you are ready. I don't think there really is anything to do. Excuse me. Like, I don't think there's any gear or anything to buy. Um... I guess I could sell these. Sure. Why not? I could use the mana. Let's go ahead and save, and I guess we're gonna go on ahead. I don't I don't happen to have the turbo cookie, I think it was called, do I? No. I'm assuming I'm gonna come back and explore a lot of different places the second time. The cleansing won't be easy. Better make sure you're well equipped. Is it true you were able to defeat Romaya? What do you have to say? Nothing. Well then, let us head out. Stay close to me, everyone. Onwards to the cleansing. Hmm? Surely you weren't thinking of coming with us. Hey, I can fight, and I'm a good support. Dwellers are impervious to all but solstice magic. Your mere presence would be a liability. Well, the Elder Mist gave me special permission. What? I'll know when to step aside. Don't worry. Make sure you don't get in the way. Headmaster's kind of a dick. <laughs> I don't like him. Which I didn't need to hear, given that Ernest is my middle name. Anyway, then he said he never used any spells on regular monsters, only to use nothing but the most expensive one when we fought a boss. I'm confused as to how any of us can any of this could be considered fun. Well, to each of their own, I guess. Going somewhere, Captain? If it's always dark here, how will we know when the eclipse happens? You'll know. The curse of the night shroud is strong, but it won't withstand the eclipse. Can't wait to see that. Any moment now. Rest. 
Valir? The time has come. Solstice Warriors, channel through me. That was awesome. Quickly now, our window is short. Surely we'll defeat the Dweller of Woe, and our journey will be complete, and there'll be no twists or surprises to come. This will all go smoothly. Erlina and Brugaves, you will clear the basement. Do be careful, the glutton is a fearsome foe. We'll see about that. Zael and Valir, you will cleanse the ballroom and make your way to the gardens. The botanical horror will pose a challenge, but you have what it takes. We won't fail. Remember what you learned. Lunar magic against the soul-based ones and solar magic for those more concrete. I am heading upstairs to start working on the final seal. Join me when you are done, and we will rid the world of the Dweller of Woe once and for all. Godspeed, Solstice Warriors. What if we just go the wrong way? Yeah, it's not gonna let us. <laughs> Fine. There is a treasure chest up here, though, that we should try and get. Uh, we're not. That was an accident. <laughs> Is there another secret passage over here then? No. Hmm. There you are. I can't fight the Dweller with you, but I'll do what I can otherwise. Hey, you must be Sarai. I'm Garl. Thanks for the help earlier. We're glad to have you back. Don't mention it. Mm, do we want Sarai in the party? I feel like maybe not. We don't have any combos with her, and Garl's such a strong healer that I think we need to keep him around. The, the music's changed up here. That was way too early for that block. Some of these moves are really hard to block because you have no idea when they're actually going to come out. These books are probably weak to solar magic, huh? Too late now. Thank you for getting rid of those evil spirits. Here, you can use this fire if you need to rest. I was just hoping we'd get one of those. The 
The Waltzers? Hmm. I'm guessing Lunar Magic is what we want to use here. I had no idea who was getting attacked either time. Oh, okay, that worked. That was really bad, but it worked. Over generations, the evil presence has fully engulfed these rooms and halls. Are you here to help? Then perhaps you should take a look at the torch left of the fireplace. Note says little juice boxes are for lunch only. Fascinating. Um This should deal some significant damage, right? Pretty good. Okay, that kill, I didn't expect that. That was complete luck. <laughs> that was not well timed, but that was just fucking luck. Judging by these defenses, maybe Garl isn't the best option here. But I want to be able to heal, so... Okay, this one's going to attack, and then the Sun Ball will hopefully finish them off. I can't use Sun Ball. Okay. Um, yeah, planning these out really isn't my strength. Mm, close. Oh, God. As well use mending light here, right? No reason not to. It'll be good in the long run. Mm -hmm. That one's kind of annoying. I'm really not sure what you're supposed to do about that one. Cradle fish pie. All right. Hello there. You look strange. Are you alive or something? Hey, friend. We're looking for the ballroom. Do you know where it is? Oh, yes. It's somewhere beyond this door. Tell you what. You make me a sandwich, and I'll open the door for you. Deal. How do you like yours? What? Hmm. 
game is fucking weird. Oh, I wasn't paying attention. Wait, I wasn't paying attention. Uh, yeah, that was just one, right? Stop. We need three. Four? Did I get the Hepar? Whatever that is. Okay, there we go. Sure. And done. We should go see that ghost now. The Master Ghost Sandwich. Did you make my sandwich? Ooh, that is one good sandwich. Here's a little extra for your trouble. A deal's a deal. The ballroom is through the library behind me. Just crown the king and you're basically there. To open the secret passage to the garden, just look at the pot in the garden. Places now? Oh wait, Garo left the party. Oh, and we can swap mid-battle. Okay, that's kind of cool. I like that. fucking coin toss if I'm gonna get that one or not. The king is wearing the knight's helm. Take it? Yeah, so we're supposed to crown the king. So I assume we need a crown from over here somewhere? I just realized how low health we are. This might be rough. Though, if I can build up a combo meter, we'll be fine. I wonder if swapping takes up a turn, or if I can swap and immediately move. Oh! Oh, okay, we're dead. Shit! <laughs> okay.
That move's kind of bullshit. There's like no visual um, indication of when it's actually going to go off. this again. See what we're gonna do with this. Not much. At least we killed the one. Fucking Christ. Thunder at least has some sort of a build-up to, um, I was gonna say, at least Thunder has some sort of a build-up to when you block it. Fire just fucks, just, just fucks you up. test out the swapping. Oh, okay, so it doesn't take up a turn to swap. Yeah, he's just, he's down. Yeah. Wow, that didn't deal very much at all. Ugh. I guess we don't need to do anything fancy at this point. We can just beat it down. There's a crown up there. Um, what was this, though? The question pack three. Still don't know what to do with those. So here's the crown. We've got nothing important to say. Okay, and there's the secret passage. Maybe? Hmm. 
I feel like I should go back to the campfire to rest. Before I party wipe again. <laughs> I'm guessing there's some sort of a secret passage that leads to that chest. But I have no idea how to get there. I see. So that's the order for that side. That's not the secret. Okay, it's a combo and the secret passage. Zale and Sarai learned combo X Strike. Cave. Don't I already have one of those? Plus eight magic defense. Can Sarai wear that? Oh, she's already got one. That's what it is. Oops. Yeah. No reason not to put it on Garl. This side of the wall feels brittle. Let's see if we can break through. Is this to the... Oh no, it's in here. Okay. It's actually probably more useful than... Uh, I thought it was going to take me to that treasure chest that I was confused about. Before I get caught up in another battle, I need to use the bathroom again.
forgot to unmute again. <laughs> I guess we're just gonna go for the same strategy as before, except Valir can't use her magic yet. What if we just... What if I just do this? Okay, that works. And Zale and Garl, I imagine, can finish this one off. Okay. And what have you got to say? Thank you for clearing the evil spirits. It sure feels warmer now. Are you going to the gardens to fight the botanical horror? This chair feels very cold. Hmm. Seems to be a switch at the bottom of the pot. Hmm. Oh, okay. And we found a rainbow conch for that. I still don't know what to do with those. Um, I imagine the botanical horror. Maybe not. Oh, it's a hedge maze. Interesting. Forgot how fast that attack was. Are you fucking kidding me? Really? God, I'm so sick of those heals. up while we're still in battle. We should be able to finish off this pretty quickly.
need him to build up his mana a little bit more, because I think the solar magic's going to deal more, more damage here. I think. She's dead, but yeah. Boy, that's fucking annoying. I boost. Can I just kill this thing right off the bat? I can. It's actually really useful to do that. Let's switch for Sarai, actually. Just because I don't want Zale taking damage right now. How did I miss both? If I can build up the combo meter just a little bit more, I can switch Zale in. And we can do the Mending Light, but I guess not. Okay. And here's a campfire. So obviously we're getting close to the Botanical Horror, right? It actually gives us the health bars for all of his, uh, all of the arms. Hmm. Timing doesn't seem too hard. Not on the surface, at least. I didn't boost. Shit. Holy shit, why was that timing not working? Why aren't you blocking? Uh, this got really bad really fast. Time that. <laughs> okay, this is a really bad fight.
doesn't even look like I'm mistiming it. It just looks like the block isn't coming out at all. Okay, we're gonna go all out here. Swap you out. Okay, that's pretty good. That was solid damage. Do you think we want to take out the top flowers first? Because their quill shot deals a lot more damage and is a lot harder to block. too soon. I wasn't paying attention. that one. That was a waste. It was a waste of that boost. I don't think this will- oh, it's just enough to kill. Okay, perfect. At least they don't heal back to full. That's, uh, that would make this really difficult. So, let's see. Again, we want to take out the top flowers first to prevent the quill, sh quill shot from getting us. Let's just do the boost, because that should be enough to kill. Mm-hmm.
That one wasn't too bad. Alright, we accomplished our part of the mission. Let's regroup with the others. Is there anything hidden up here? No. Kind of expecting something to be hidden there. The dweller is yours. Good luck. Okay, bye. Good work taking down the botanical order. The Dweller of Woe is behind this barrier. Join me now. My dear Garl, your courage has been humbling, but you absolutely have to sit this one out. No worries, Headmaster, I'll just watch. In position. rune I prepared will force the Dweller of Woe to materialize. I will have to maintain focus for it to be vulnerable. I trust you to keep me alive and take down this spawn of evil. You can do it. It comes. Brace yourself and do not be fooled by its appearance. It is immensely powerful. Oh, I can control Moraine. Hold Rune. Focus on Lunar Rune to increase party damage or to heal. Wait, that didn't do anything? Oh, because that was... Okay, right. That wasn't a magic attack. Holy shit. Um
Seems really straightforward so far. just heal? This is a weird battle so far. So it won't even show its true form. So much for that rune. The preparations were done properly. We just need more direct light from the eclipse. Garl, get up onto the roof and find a way to get more light in. Now! I... Okay, I'm on it. Alright, I won't let them down. There's gotta be a ladder here somewhere. So far, so good. Now to find a breach or something. Too solid. Gotta keep looking. Um, this isn't it. Come on, Garl. Your friends need you. Alright, there's an opening behind this debris. Time to smash through. Let's see now. It's all clogged up with rubble. Ugh, too heavy for me. Can't give up now. Think, Garl, think. Oh, that thing Yolande told me about gunpowder. Maybe if I just... I bet this'll do just right. Okay, better find cover. It worked. That's bound to come in handy later, too. Garl learned the combat skill Cooker Surprise. What, he just blows up his cooking pot? <laughs> That's kind of funny. What the? He could have warned us before pulling something like that. He did it. Perfect. The Dweller is showing its true form. Let us finish this. Okay. That was solar and lunar magic? That's interesting. Everyone, 
Oh shit, you got your turn already? Holy crap. Oof, holy shit. Okay, all of a sudden this thing got really tough. <laughs> He's mending light. Good. Jesus, that one's hard to time. What? My defense isn't coming out again. My blocks just aren't working sometimes. Oh my god, the timing on that is brutal. Holy shit.
Oh, we can't even use the Moonerang. Shit. Um, but you can use the, the Sunball. This thing is tanky, it's not even a... Uh... Like a lot of the other bosses, when you deal a lot of damage, you can start to see them weakening. This one is tanky. It's not looking weaker at all. Quick, obliterate the core. I won't let you. Sarai? Drop your weapon right now. Tell them what you... Erlina, explain yourself at once. Use the crystal now, Brugaves. I'd rather make this quick. Brugaves, don't. We tried reasoning with you. You left us no other option. Do it.
So, you really did hold up your end of the bargain after all. Go back from where you came, fiends. These minds are not yours to twist. Oh, is the old man tense? Tense and confused, too. What do you want? Why, the very same thing your two former friends? Same thing as your two former friends here. For those born during a solstice to live free. Are they not forced to train? Train and fight horrors, too? Liars, you worship the Fleshmancer. Without Solstice Warriors, the world would be doomed. This meets our conditions. Erlina, why? We took the deal. All they asked was for us to conjure a blood moon. And then there will be no more of this nonsense. The Blood Moon and a Dweller Core? No! My, you catch on quick. At long last, the Dweller of Strife will be resurrected. Resurrected and made stronger, too. Brugaves, how are you okay with this? Have you ever wondered what it would feel like for your life to be your own? But why? We just defeated the last Dweller. You can't truly know that. And don't you see that absolutely none of this endless conflict is your fault? That doesn't mean it's not our responsibility. Or yours, by the way. It's not too late, Rugaves. Destroy the core. I'm sorry, Valir. We made our decision. Why give up now? Some of us could still ascend. Into guardian gods? Don't make me laugh. How many centuries were spent suffering and wait for this fake promise? Don't you think it would have happened by now? Enough talk. We must complete the ritual before the eclipse subsides. No, you can't. Oh, I believe we can. Can and will, too. The time has come to resurrect the Dweller of Strife. Now give us the Blood Moon. No. No! Headmaster. Hey, at least we're safe for now. I'm sure the three of you can take on whatever that Dweller of Strife is. You don't understand. The Dweller of Strife took everything from us. More than two dozen Solstice Warriors, and yet... But the Elder Mist said... How could they? Headmaster. Let's hurry back. He doesn't seem badly hurt. Probably just a lot to take in. Nothing soup won't fix. Not the twins. Easy, Headmaster. You need rest. Thank you, young lad. You have been quite caring. Don't mention it. Zael, Valir. Yes, Headmaster? I need more time to recover. Our enemies must be at the Fleshmaster's old castle on Mesa Island by now. 
Mesa Island is currently unreachable, but I trust a solution will come to me if I meditate. In the meantime, please go check on Brisk. Assess the damage and do your best to help any survivors in need. Right away. Thank you, young ones. I will catch up with you when I am ready. I'll go immediately. See you in Brisk. Thank you, young one. Okay, he already said that. Let's go ahead and rest. New story unlocked, The Three Sisters. You know what, I, I want to hear this, but at the same time, I'm drained. I think I'm going to call it. That seems like a good place to call it for the night. We'll pick it up maybe tomorrow if I'm feeling a little bit better, or definitely Wednesday if not tomorrow. Alright, so that'll do it for the stream today. Uh, take care.